Welcome to this edition of Video Drone by DIY3DTech.com. In this episode, I want to share something I designed for the unique uh, Typhoon H. So what I did is I whipped up this mount um, and 3D printed it that actually goes onto the bottom of the Typhoon. So what this does is I picked up for about uh, 20, 25 bucks or so uh, this top mounting bracket, which comes with the balls and some mounting pins and then what I did from this is I designed up this bracket now I'll have this bracket out on Think Versus along with a couple different versions and what I did is I designed this bracket up with a GoPro mount so as you see here it's got a GoPro style situation and I've got this 360 camera so what happens now is I can take this and if I move this over here all I do is slide this on okay took a little bit to get it slid on there uh, but now, as you can see, I can now fly, it, it clears the ground a little bit tight with this, this particular camera, but as you can see now, I can fly different cameras on this uh, copter. So this is a pretty cool design because one of the things I'm going to do is extend this a little bit because what I, the reason I started this project is I want to design my own camera bay that goes on here. So in a future version, what I'm going to do is set this up so I can have different types of full spectrum cameras. Let me move these out of the way a little bit. Uh, different types of full spectrum cameras in that that are mounted on here and have a built-in transmitter into this assembly. So I'm gonna probably round this housing out a, a bit, but again, I wanted to experiment with this uh, with the GoPro style mount. So that's why I'll put the blank mount out there as well as the GoPro, as well as a quarter 20 mount that you could put a, say, small ball head on down here and mount your camera to because I think this would be really cool for flying 360 cameras because again the way that the legs lift up and can come out of the way so I think you can get some really interesting shots out of this guy so anyways I wanted to share this with the community so if you're a unique pilot this will be out on Thingiverse I'll have the, the link down below I also have the links to where you can get this top bracket I definitely suggest using this top bracket the commercial version um, if I can pull this out now because the, the pieces, the way that this comes together, you don't want it delaminating and coming apart in flight. And this is where the pressure is really held here, the way that this all comes together. So uh, you want the injected molded, molded version, you know, and then the, uh, I've printed this with to, uh, 0.2 layer height, I think about 25% infill, um, 0.8 millimeter shells. And so this has come out pretty good. I'm going to probably work up a couple more designs. Um, one of the things notice I built in sort of a, a little bit of a raised base here to handle lateral forces. So this is pretty strong. I have printed this out of PLA, um, which I think is, is roughly print, plenty strong depending upon what you're going to do because you don't want to hang a ton of weight from this thing. And again, I've got the pins in here on the rubber balls. So hopefully you found it interesting. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Be sure to also follow me on Thingiverse. I put out a lot of new, neat stuff all the time. Uh, and subscribe is going to be coming up over there. Hit the subscribe button. Again, put out a lot of content on this channel. And uh, if you've got some ideas for this or what I could do with this, let me know in the comments below. Happy to give it a shot. Cheers and see you in the next video.